And uh, basically what we do is press up instrumental tracks to everything we do. Because when rap started, rap started with what they did was, which was so ingenious, was to create a whole form of urban style music from just two turntables and two records and a mic. Where's the day? How's everybody doing? How's everybody feeling? Everybody's peace? Everybody doing good? Um, I hope you're peace because what we're about to listen to now, you guys ask me what kind of music I grew up listening to, what was my shit. I'm an East Coast hip hop head. So of course I'm gonna start with some hip hop shit, some East Coast shit, some hard shit. Everybody who read the title and already know, you already know who the fuck the Mash Out Posse is. M-O-P, Mash Out Posse. So, with that being said, stick around people. I listen to your fucking classical music. I listen to your country music, your damn funk, your punk, your ska, your metal, your rock and roll, your jazz, your blues, your freaking folk music. I listen to all your shit. Listen to one of my joints. Listen to something that I fuck with. Even though this song, at the time, would have caused me to do a lot of stupid shit in the streets, because it amps you up. It makes you want to do some shit. You know, just like when you listen to fucking that metal shit and you want to go cut a kitten's head off and then take the kitten and try to sew it back together and then ask him why he don't move. This is the type of shit right here. M.O.P. How about some hardcore? Let's go.
ain't sleeping, I roll deep like a motherfucking Puerto Rican. So when I rate my competition, look sadly. The punk ass niggas, I make it happen like a ride carry. I got shit for niggas that roll bow. Low famous like an orthopedic shoe. I got mad soul. I'ma kill him before I duck him. Because yo, mother made a mother had him and motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? Well, goddamn. That shit make you wanna go rob somebody right the fuck now. She was dangerous. Um. MOP, Mash Out Posse. This was the first, not the first joint they put out, but it's probably the most amp song that they put out, like the most known song when they first came out. It's Billy Dan's and Lil Fame. Go check out more um, MOP if you really want to fuck with some of the shit that I listen to. I still listen to MOP every time I go to the gym. They just they just amp you up. They like they just super amp you up. And the music is dope. If you take away the lyrics, you can listen to the music. It's still groovy and shit. You just got to get into it. I know it's not for everybody, but shit, every music is not for everybody. You just got to give yourself a chance, listen to it, no preconceived notions, and just go into it and enjoy it for what it is. You, and if you pick shit apart, look, when I listen to all your music, all your suggestions, I usually find something in there that I like. Even if I don't like the song in its entirety, I usually find one or two things and I grab it and I hold on to that and fuck with the music just to give it a chance. Give it a chance, you know what I'm saying? If not... Oh well, I'll enjoy it myself. I don't need you to enjoy it. This shit was dope. I don't care what you say. So, that being said, I'm out. Double RT. Rap, Ratch, for rap. I don't know what this is. I don't know what the fuck Wednesdays, maybe? I don't know when I'm going to put this up. I'm saying what the fuck Wednesdays, but who knows when I'll put this out. It's what it is. I talk too much. I'm rambling. Trying to find niggas to rob. Trying to, trying to find, trying to find niggas to rob. Trying to find niggas to rob. Trying to, trying to find, trying to find niggas to rob. Trying to find niggas to 